What up, Warren Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's JJ. This men's basketball video is brought to you by the fine folks at Naples Rib Company. And it's Thursday bowl night in the Walter Pyramid as Long Beach State hosts USC. Mike Caffey and the 49ers. First game in 12 days, still trying to get that second win in the season. And it's the marquee matchup of the non-conference because Trojans rode their horses south for this one. Long Beach native Rashawn Prince, part of the maroon and gold as head coach Andy Enfield from the infamous free-flying Gulf Coast team of last year's NCAA tournament. And radio personality Petros Papadakis repping the St. John Bosco jersey. Sean McGrew for all those angry white running backs out there. Love it. From the tip, doors open, man. It was back and forth like an open run, and with the help of seven first half turnovers, it was Long Beach State who took the advantage in the open floor. 14 fast break points for the 49ers. There, AJ Spencer, here, in a game so caffeinated, be like Mike. Two run out and ones for the junior point guard, Long Beach State up early, 11-10. The first subs were Super, Tyler Lamb for Long Beach, Ro P for USC, both making immediate impacts. Here's Ro P, offensive rebound, gets to the line, taking two of 25 free throws for the Trojans on the night. First shot for Lamb, right back like he left something early. First NCAA action in 13 months for the UCLA transfer, and if he had a more sudden impact, he would have dropped two points from the bench. Hate for SC never dies. Long Beach stayed up 22-16 with about 10 left in the first. Not the only one off the bench balling. Hark, Archangel sing, Michaela Sal. And then Gully, 8 of 9 49ers on the floor ended up scoring, but Pishon Howard's 19 points keeps the Trojans within shouting distance. 49ers offense, the song that never ends in the first half. Lamb's got chops. 18 points in 12 minutes for Tyler Lamb. USC just basically got out Gulf Coasted here in the first half. Did not have a point in the open floor. Long Beach State just outrunning the Trojans and the near capacity crowd just loves it. Everything seemed to be going Long Beach's way in this one. Loose balls, they were falling to the team in white almost every single time. DJ, Dan Jennings with 10 points and eight rebounds and three blocks. 49ers trying to get on the run out. Lamb's call for a travel? And that doesn't make much sense, but the ball don't lie. On that ensuing possession, the SC turnover leads to a Caffey layup. The breaks continue to go Long Beach's way. Howard for three, he gets fouled. That's a bad play, you don't wanna shoot the jump shooter, but he misses both free throws. Long Beach State up nine. Then the pendulum swings, an air ball. DJ straight into Gazette's photographer, William Johnson. He and his equipment would be okay. The 49ers, not so much. USC goes on a 13-4 run. Orem Oribe with 17 points and 10 rebounds. Jones getting in there. Long Beach State up four before Caffey goes behind the backy, and it's 68-62 with four minutes left. But oh, oh, Oribe. He had quite a game and won. It is a one-point game, a little less than two to go. And then back-to-back -back Long Beach turnovers. Jacob with the pick six. It's now 71-70 USC, their first lead since the opening minutes. Same score, next SC possession, best Long Beach State defense of the night. Shot clock violation show. With the 49ers trailing by one point, 24 seconds left, Mike Caffey is going to bring this ball in. No one is ready to stop ball. To the 10 with the kiss onions. The junior guard will stop for no man because, well, that's a lane, folks. That is a lane. Two three-point attempts would come up short for the Trojans. And winner, winner, big time win at home for Long Beach State dinner. First Pac-12 win for the Long Beach State 49ers at home since it was the Pac-10 back in 1999 against, yes, these USC Trojans. Long Beach State takes it 72-71, exactly what this team and this program needed. A marquee win in the non-conference on TV for everyone to see. Long Beach State going to play one more non-conference game at home. That's Saturday at noon against Montana State Billings. They're going to go on the road and then come back home for conference play. For all of that Long Beach State athletics coverage, you stay right here because this is your home for everything local sports.